and Wizards are on fire. John Wall and company looking for their first 11 game win streak since all the way back in 2005 tonight. They're taking on the Utah Jazz and the Wizards. They lead the league in assists and they're sharing early. This is John Wall kicking it out to Bradley Beal for the three. The Wizards had six assists in the half. Wall finds Paul Pierce for the left. That's nicely done. Then it's John Wall to a cutting Paul Pierce. Watch Paul Pierce cut. That's how you get open. That's how you get easy baskets. And Paul Pierce, a little rise and shine there. 17-15, Washington in front. Andre Miller passes to Nene, who posterizes Rudy Gobert. You got to see this one again. Nene, 10 points off the bench, including the hammer there. Utah, though, in front, 30-28. to Kevin Serafin's pass stolen by Trey Burke, who takes it all the way to the other end for the nice little reverse layup. Jazz Force, 12 turnovers for 21 points in the half. Utah up 37-32. They led it by five at the break. Wizards defense taken over in the second half, though, after the Alec Burks miss. Wizards in transition, and there he is again, Bradley Beal. Get a game high, 22 points. Washington up 52-51. John Wall had a season high, five steals. Here is one of them. Stealing the ball, going the other way, taking it from Trey Burke, and nobody's going to catch John Wall. Washington up 61-56. Rasul Butler passing to Nene in the post, who makes a nice spin move and finishes with the reverse layup and the foul. Wizards outscored Utah 52 38 in the paint. Later fourth quarter, Trey Burke to Ennis Cantor, who misses his first shot, but then very much in Mo Malone fashion, gets the rebound, puts it back up in. He had 10 points and 11 boards. That's a double-double. It's 87-81, but Bradley Beal finishing things off. Just such a gorgeous shot. Knocks it down there. 9 of 17 shooting overall, and the Wizards keep on winning. 11 games in a row now. The final score, 93 to 84.